Day two of the 2021 Olympus Rally is here, and yesterday there was a lot of drama out on the stages. We had some offs, and we actually even had some cars that had to retire due to the stage conditions. Now, the weather is clearing up just a little bit. However, there was a lot of rain last night, and that's going to play a factor in today's stages. Today's stages? We have two of them and we're running them two times each. However, these are the longer stages of the weekend. Now let's go talk to some of the drivers to see what they have to say about today. Ken, day two is here. We got a chance to talk on some of the stage ends yesterday. How's the car feeling? I know that you said you had some hours on there, but how are you feeling today? Uh, feeling better. We'll see how the weather uh, goes today. Hopefully there's a bit more grip. I uh, made a big change on the car last night. We are constantly changing it yesterday. I, just trying to find a comfort level and a balance with it. I just don't know the car at all. So even making changes, I'm uncertain. But it is what it is. That's what happens when you race a new uh, race car. But stages yesterday were very difficult. Today's are a bit easier, a bit more straightforward. Yesterday there was so much change in grip underneath the trees and then the openings. Uh, this Today there's a lot more gravel on the road and it, they're faster stages. So it uh, should work a little better for my driving style. Hopefully we've got the car for, sort of changed to something that'll work a little better for me. And uh, yeah, today's basically a big test for me. If, if it goes well, I can put a little bit of pressure on Travis, but he's got a pretty good lead on me. Going that yesterday, we ran Wildcat once, canceled stage eight. Thoughts on Wildcat? It was 18.60 miles overall. At the end of the day, how did you feel about that stage? I really like the stage. It's quite a challenging stage. I mean, make a great WRC stage. That's how good it is. So would the, the other stages too. But with the rain, that stage was incredibly difficult. It was like driving on ice. So really unfortunate that Brandon found one of the slippiest spots and it happened to be right in front of a bridge. Uh, really bummer to see him go off. Uh, he was having a, a great day, uh, but that's rally, unfortunately. So I would have loved to have driven it again, but yeah, in those conditions, it just was difficult for us top guys, let alone the rest of the field. So um, yeah, it is what it is though. That's, that's a really difficult and technical stage, especially with the rain. All right, Bill, last night we got a chance to talk late into the evening. Obviously, we're missing a vehicle right behind us. Walk us through what was the decision to pull out Brandon from day two. Uh, so uh, so Brandon had an off on, uh, on stage seven last night. Um, he, he struck uh, what we believe was a part of a bridge abutment. Uh, so he's, he sustained some damage to the car. Took us a while to get the car back off of stage and bring it back here last night. Uh, when we did that, we, we felt like the damage was substantial enough that we didn't want to put uh, Brandon and John at any kind of risk. We wanted to make sure that the car was back to 100% and, uh, and really inspect it properly. So we made the decision to retire the car for today. Uh, only Travis will be running for us today and we'll take the car back to Vermont Sports Car, check it over, make sure it's safe and uh, come back stronger for Southern Ohio. And I know this has got to be heartbreaking for Brandon, especially since he split the stages with Travis yesterday. And, and going off of that, how is he feeling? Have you got a chance to talk to him this morning? I haven't talked to Brandon this morning. Um, he was showing some serious pace yesterday. Uh, it was looking like he was chasing down Travis for the lead. Uh, so really encouraging pace from him. Um, I, I think he was really feeling like this was an opportunity for him. So, you know, hopefully he's not too discouraged. We want to make sure he maintains that momentum going into the next, uh, well, the next six rounds for the rest of the season. But uh, overall, he's doing really, really well for us and the pace is coming. So he's going to continue to get quicker as we go. Callum, day two is here. We have some of the longer stages today, running them two times each for a total of over a little about 40 miles. Walk us through what you think is going to happen today. Yeah, well, today's stages are a lot faster than yesterday. A um, lot more high speed. So, yeah, uh, be a little bit more challenging um, for us in the R5 cars. But we're definitely looking forward. The stages have been really, we're really enjoying the stages so far, especially yesterday's stages were great. And, uh, yeah, I'd say these stages today have been no different. Well, yeah, big lens, so we'll enjoy them. We had a chance to talk early morning before you went out on any of the stages, and I said they were very Welsh-like. After a full day of running them yesterday, still agree? <laughs> Funny enough, I think they're a little bit more slippery than we, we imagined so it was. So, but, yeah, um, they're a bit like Wales, so a bit slippery, like, but, um, yeah, they're, they're still very enjoyable to drive. And, yeah, hopefully to, the rain stays away today and we can enjoy them a bit more.
talking about that, we've got, uh, like I said, two of the longer stages. When you had a chance for a recce a few days ago, did you find any difficulties or challenges on either one of the stages today? Yeah, I think these stages, are, they're obviously a wee bit wider, but there's a lot of loose rocks on these stages, so I'd say punches could be a, a thing today. Hopefully, hopefully we don't get any punches all the same, but yeah, I think it could be, punches could slip into play today for a couple of guys, but yeah, hopefully, hopefully not, but yeah. Awesome. Well, I'll let you get back. I know the stages will be starting soon. Best of luck to you and the team. All right. Thank you very much. Cheers, Tim. Thank you.